Well, gee, <laughs> this is such a surprise. I mean, we would have liked to have given you a shower. Thank you. I just had a shower. Well, then, let me give you both a party at the club. Are you out of your mind? I'm not staying married. Why ever not? Because, Suzanne, unlike you, I do not do these things every time the light turns green. <laughs> anyway, if it weren't for you, I wouldn't be in this mess in the first place. Me? What did I do? You practically dared me. You said I couldn't have Reese even if I wanted him. You know I can't pass up a remark like that. Well, at least you'll get some money out of it. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Alimony. Reese owes you. After all, you gave me the finest hours of your life. I don't want alimony. I want out. We were intoxicated. I understand. He's saying he likes you. He just doesn't want to be married to you. Yes, I got that. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with my hearing. In command. This must be what it's like at Chrysler when Lee Iacocca has the flu. <laughs> Julia, there's a telegram here for you. We haven't opened it, but we can just smell it's from Reese. Now I've been up those stairs for the last time. If you want it, come and get it. Is that true? Did you get a telegram? In a manner of speaking. If there's one thing Julia can't resist, it's a man admitting he was wrong. <laughs> hmm. Well, she seems to be resisting pretty well so far. 